Yo, what's up, guys? This is DJ Anime or DJ FR, also known. Can call me Alan Reyes. <laughs> or either way, just this is Alan again, and just got this uh, Robocop a while ago. Yeah. So this is I don't know. It's a new one. It's a 2017, but. Yeah, I think it's a 2017. This thing is probably on hold like two years because of the COVID. Yeah, the COVID thing. I just want to share you. I did a live a while ago, live video on Facebook, and do it same thing right now, but a little bit different because I got problems with this new figure. It's like it's been stored for a long time. Yeah, I can't even move the hands properly. It's like it's stuck. And, okay, let's just show you the box. This thing had a window. And this is a picture of Robocop. And backdrop on the back. It's, uh, it's just like a back alley backdrop there. And I even have a hard time taking it off with a clamshell. Had this uh, string attached to it. So this is the back of the box. That's what it looks like. So this is oh there it is. I was looking for the instructions. So this is the only instructions for the gimmick. Place for we auto nine pistol holster chamber but it didn't say put it properly <laughs> close tight and then panel do not press side panel it may break the function do not press on side panel but yeah so that's how it is you got just now yeah just now I noticed that there's an instruction in it so okay thanks for the warnings but it didn't says uh, some pictures that you can pop off the hands like this yeah. first on my live video on Facebook I can't even move the hands yeah I can't even move this it was stuck like that so I got time to since I already unboxed it it has a you know when you're doing live you have to unbox the thing that it's already uh, what you call that it was closed sealed tape yeah mint and sealed box MISB or thing so I'm gonna show you the head skull of uh, Murphy yeah nice head skull there nicely detailed out far it's I thought it was kinda off but if you look at up close on this uh, front view really looks had a nice resemblance to it like Peter Weller's there it's in there so I checked uh, I have this uh, 2011 thing 2011 Robocop 3 so I got a loose that doesn't have a box he had some scratches on so I tried I bought it with has uh, damage yeah you know, I, I bought it even though it's damaged because I don't have a Robocop but I really want to check it out so this thing already broke on this part right here the hole which holds the bracket there so you can easily take it off because the part right here it's already broken as you can see so I just put it on top Anyway, I was talking. I was thinking about how the M9. I was having a problem with the the new one. So let's check it out. How you put it inside? So you had to. I tried slide it in first like that. But even though I slide it in, I still had to put the gun a bit inside. It has to be the the gun should be properly fit inside but not like that 
can see on the light still out the handle is still out it's supposed to be in it so what are we gonna try to do this thing so it's gotta be somehow you have to put the gun like this this first on top then try to press it down a bit there okay I'll lose it on video let's try it again let's try it again so it'll be hard if we don't have that that you know, part right here so I'm just gonna show you this this one part first on top slide it on top that then try to push it in there so it's supposed to be flat the gun the auto 9 supposed to be flat like that I even mistakenly said M9 so it's just like auto 9 so there I put the gun there and <laughs> this thing is already broke let's try to put it in there and this pressed it right here put until you see the the panel as uh, the so a bit lower let's put it higher okay so there push it in till that thing comes out and put it back right there so the auto 9 is inside when you put, pop it out on um, this uh, one 2017 yeah this thing is a 2017 come on do a close up yeah 2017 so this is a 2017 on the other side it says I don't see anything Orion on, on this thing it's just a studio canal I know the canal image something about this one right here in 2017 it's uh, I believe it's uh, come on close up this is 2011 Orion 2011 Orion there so that's a big difference now you know this thing is like they just add the head sculpt and this part right here the one that he can punch it to the uh, computer database and connects it. it has a burst effect for the M9 okay, let's try to show you that uh, now to open this up I'll try to hold on to this on top oh they they you can see that the gun flew <laughs> it's the first time it happened to me so okay so the gun flew there you go this is the uh, same M9 as the 2011 Robocop 3 NECA so we had to put on the burst on probably this position like this you can put this also on the old M9s they have the same sculpt yeah so this is how it looks like there okay and the hands the same thing there are a lot of discoveries I, I seen on the uh, 2011 I thought it was fixed but you can move the waist waist articulation there so there's that's that's all it is you can pop off the head of the uh, 2011 you can put this thing there but first uh, let's put back the uh, M9 huh? with this one the this part right here I'm having a hard time so you can slide the gun on top of it first then put it position with the hole until you press this part right here holding this cover to uh till it's uh it's uh flattened down the handle should be flattened down over there let's try to close it uh, there so let's try close it. oh you can see it's still not in it you might break the thing so you had to press a little bit harder on that just to put the gun properly on the rack there 
should be should be flattened out so the handle of the gun is not going to touch this part right here now see if that works slowly closing it there so it's there it's uh, in it let's try to open up nah I'm not going to open up again it's not there's no problems with it anyway okay so there uh-huh 